and we had a very good meeting that went on into the evening. And what Tim asked was for John Bozak of Sun Microsystems and Tim Bray, a very respected SGML user and guru, to please lead a committee of experts. Can you tackle the problem of saying SGML is problematical because it allows emitted N tags plus all sorts of other things, minor things. Can you, within 18 months, no more, do a very quick report on how to do a subset of full SGML that's cleaner and basically it was agreed. We've got to get this out quickly, this what came to be known as XML. And there was good as a word, I think it was 1996 when the first XML draft spec was delivered. This is you and here are your favorite websites. Go out to your favorite blogs. Is there anything new there? Nope. Every time you look for something new and it's not there, You've wasted valuable time. Let's consider the new and fast way, which is simply taking these arrows and turning them the other way. New thing from your news sites comes to you instead. It's like Netflix compared to the video store. This has been RSS in plain English. It's a more general protocol for exchanging data uh, in near real time between any number of networked networked entities. The protocol uses XML streams, not documents, but unlike a lot of chat protocols, we're not sending individually consumable documents. Uh, from the moment we connect to the moment we disconnect, we have one kind of continuous stream. And the biggest benefit, I think, to using XMPP over other protocols is, like email, it's federated. 